hi guys this is Sam here this is my another video in the DevOps series today we're gonna see how to integrate Jenkins with the Bitbucket server whether you're using the local server or you're using the cloud one when we create the CI pipelines in the DevOps there is a requirement for the repository integration with the Jenkins build server so today I'll show you how to integrate Bitbucket server with the Jenkins so first you need to install the Jenkins server then let's start first go to Jenkins server then manage Jenkins to integrate the Bitbucket with the uh, Jenkins server we need to install the Bitbucket plugin first so you just need to go to plugins and then just click the available here I'll type Bitbucket so here there is a Bitbucket plugin I'll just install it without restart and then I'll just click the restart Jenkins so after installing the Bitbucket plugin it will restart the Jenkins server meanwhile I'll go to Bitbucket server and then click the repository and then we'll go to settings and then webhooks here I'll add the new webhook the title might be I'll give the Jenkins and then add the Jenkins server URL so I'll copy the URL copy and then paste it here uh, this is paste the slash add bitbucket hyphen hook and don't forget to add the backslash at the end of the URL then I'll add some triggers so choose trigger from full list the first was a push repository then I'll add merged and then upload and then I'll save the uh, webhook just click save so this is my Jenkins URL and go to Jenkins new item I'll create the new job that is the web job it will be freestyle project click OK and then add the repository URL so that is the git repository so I'll get the URL from Bitbucket clone copy the URL paste it into the URL box and select the credentials which I already saved in my Jenkins server then I'll add the build triggers so build trigger will be built when a change is published in Bitbucket so just check in this and you can add the build environment build uh, steps or post build actions after that save it and then we'll change something into the Bitbucket repository so I'll open the file I'll edit it like I add some dots and then commit so I'll add the commit so as soon as I commit the change into Bitbucket so it will trigger the uh, Jenkins job so we'll wait here so job is triggered now so this is the first job build job then we'll check the console output okay thank you very much if you like my video then please subscribe and comment.